Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Night Witches. So the first thing we're going to do is have a look at the map here because things have changed significantly. And yeah, House Karita is almost gone. So not much we can really do. Ghost Bear is killing down here and Comstar is pushing Jade Falcon way back. Apparently there's a loose war going on right now between Ghost Bear and uh, Jade Falcon as well so a lot of stuff's happening. Comstar is pushed up into here and then they got cut off. Um, so yeah a lot of stuff going on in the map right now so we are going to uh, basically go to ground. We're going to have to do commando raids now so we're going to um, switch ourselves here uh, and we're going to unally ourselves from the Draconis Combine. Um, just so that we can get um, more rep with other factions at this moment. Um, because chances are Draconis Combine is not going to be around for much longer. Uh, and then right away we're going to jump into a couple of contracts here. Um, we're going to do some uh, payroll seizure mission here for four skulls against some pirates, which is a recovery operation. And we might do cease and desist, or we might leave the planet and go elsewhere. But we'll see. But let's take the payroll seizure first. Um, not much we can really do otherwise. So, and it's against pirates. So we're going to take this right off the bat. And we're going to go full salvage just to see what we can get out of it. Now the, the Defiance and the Orion. Defiance is set up kind of and ready to go. It's been repaired. It's got an engine in it right now, 300. But it's got a light engine. I want to, I want to replace that with a Clan XL. And you'll notice our funds have, had dropped. We, what I did is I put a Clan XL into the Orion. So now it's ready to go. So we're going to get some C builds and put one into to the Defiance as well. I tried to do a, a double AC20 build on the Defiance. But um, if we get a Clan XL engine there, it'll give us an extra five tons, which I think we sorely need with that build. So I, I just stopped doing it. So yeah, we're going to take the main lance and we're going to take this mission and let's just do this. All right. Okay, well, we were just here with... Uh, Falcon Freeborn, so we know what this place is all about. Let's move in. So that uh, double double AC-20 build um, didn't look too bad on the Defiance. Um, definitely no problem with the heat on that build. Um, the one thing that we did have a problem with though, uh, of course. Let's do this. All right, one of the things we did have a problem with, though, um, was the ammunition. We had 11 turns of ammo, which isn't bad. Uh, but it, once again, it's the range, right? You're limited to 360 meters, plus about 10% for the pilot, um, which really isn't all that much, if you think about it. Uh, let's reserve these two. Because we'd have to get in real close for uh, that mech to be effective. So either it's got to be super fast, which we didn't even have the ability to get a supercharger or mask in there because we didn't have enough space or weight left, um, or a bigger core, which we couldn't do because of the weight. So the way I had laid it out, I tried to set it up with the um, light engine. But the XL engine gives us an extra five tons, which we sorely need, need with that build. Because I think it's going to need some secondary armament for sure. Some extended range weapons. The other, the other way to do it too, I was thinking, was that it could do it with... Um, huh. Nothing here. You could do it with... Um, with a, uh, an AC-20 and a Rack 5. So that's a possibility too. I've only got one rack five, so uh, do I want to go? I want to go this way. I think. I don't think we got a first. Uh... Oh, here we go. All right, we got something now. Got something now. So yeah, maybe the AC twenty to rack five. Um, I don't know. It's just. The AC-20 build isn't too bad as long as, like the Ultra-20 build isn't too bad as long as we're close. 
If we're not close, it's just not worth it. Okay. Ooh. Sure, let's take some shots. Let's take some shots. A um, couple of LRM 15s and L LBX AC2s with like no armor, eh? Well, let's rip through them. Um, Skate within striker range. How was it more than just these two guys? Ready for orders. Let's get this supercharger on. God, look at this thing. It's insane. I think we've only got these two guys. I think that's going to be the case. Don't blow too much up. We got to get some salvage out these guys. Um, oh, come on. Oh, there we go. There we go. Yeah. Um, let's do this. Ooh. Let's not shoot it with too much. Okay, there goes that leg. Have a seat, buddy. So we can get uh, Megasaur to kill that vehicle. Hot Dam can claim this. And then either... Uh, ooh. That's not nice. Try and go from the front to save the engine. Pretty sure that's how you do it. Right? Front. Save it. Oop, not saving anything. See ya. Okay, so I should be able to... Can I not even see him anymore? Because he fell down? God damn it. Oh. There you are. There you are. Okay, 51 left. That should do it. There it is. Nicely done. Yeah, man. Baby, yeah, I got a sharpshooter for damn sure. Alright, this should probably be it. They don't got very many people guarding this payroll. Uh, just in case, let's just move over here. There it is, folks. Good work. Four skulls, really? Well, we lost some sea bills in the drop, but no big deal. Well, I think we take the three catapult parts because, yeah. I guess. I mean, we could go with the Ultra 5. Uh, now we got the Ultra 5 anyway. Cool. Alright. Okay. Ooh, there's a C21. Two extended LRM 15s. Two light PPCs. Does that give us four catapults now? I'm pretty sure it does. Um, is there anything left of this guy? At least the arms are there. Yeah, actually not that bad. Well, it's cheap to repair. Um, I know I should just sell it at this point. <sighs> Why am I keeping this? Um... <laughs> Storage. Uh, how many do we have? Come on. Let's 
C21, C21M, C2. Yeah, I don't think we really need it. I mean, we could make a catapult squadron, but at this point in the series, I don't think there's any real need. So let's just, uh, over here in the base, let's just scrap this guy, get it out of here. That'll make our financial report. I can feel comfortable about that now. Plus we get a few other things in the uh, in the repair bay, or in the uh, storage bay. So let's go to um, star map. Let's have a look, because I don't think we're going to get anything good here. So let's try and find a good four or five skull planet around here we can take some missions on. Looks like uh, Federated Suns has moved forward to take on uh, the clans here. We could jump over here. It's 20 days though. Uh, 14 days. Maybe we take the 20 days. I was hoping to find something less than 17 because our next financial report's in 17. Uh, it's two and a half. Three. Ghost Bear and Combine. Three and a half. Half. Ah, nothing really on the front line here. Oh, there's a five skull planet. Benjamin, 13 days. Um, yeah, it sounds good. Let's hop, let's hop over to Benjamin. Cool. Excellent. All right. Got to watch our C bills right now. I want to spend money and upgrade one of those two other mechs, but just got to wait. Wait for this financial report to see what kind of missions we get in this next planet. If we get some good missions here, then um, we can definitely uh, go ahead and um, upgrade those mechs. Um, let's just continue. Don't think there's really anything. Well, you know what? I keep looking in the store, hoping to find a weapon mount, but I've yet to find one in the store. Uh, I haven't found one in here for a really long time. Nope. I mean, I've been finding, you know, half-decent ammo here or there, but I've been kind of buying as we've been going. Rack 5 double, we don't have any, so let's buy that. We got lots of ultra. Uh, we got lots of ultra twenty ammo, and we even got double loads. We got three double loads of this, so we don't have to worry about ammo for that build. Um, yeah, I don't know. All right, well, let's see what kind of contracts we're dealing with here. Uh. No planetary government contracts? Come on, guys. Really? Oh, here we go. Lost contact. Recovery mission. Ghost bears have got it. Holding it in a nearby facility. We need to raid that facility and recover the item. We can certainly do that. Cool. Okay, well, at least we got one mission here. Uh, definitely taking the 521. All right, let's not get trashed on this mission, guys. Let's take our main lance. Um, gonna go with the overheater, I think, for sure. All right, let's just, you know what? Uh, we, we better check our pilots. Hang on one sec. Better check the pilots. I'm mostly concerned about Hot Dam. If we can get some more skills on her, that's great. So Baba Yaga, still good. Chupacabra, still good. Well, I'm here. Hot Dam. Yeah, okay, so... What were we saving up for? Piloting, probably. Right? To get the plus two evasion? So let's save for that. Megasaur, I think, is probably pretty good. We want to go with more gunnery? Like, I mean... I don't think so. I think we just want to go max guts on this one. Um, sunflower. Speed of sound. Sonic! Yeah, I think we're good. What can I do for you? Okay. Lost contact. Here we go. Five twenty-one. Ghost bear minus nine. Deploy. Command interface initiated. All right.
Okay, well, we go. at least we're going to be in cool water. Um, I want both you and Megasaur. Wow, you went first too, really. To try and get out of this water fast to be of any use to us. Roger. Full speed. Actually, you know what? Um, sh I did not mean to do that. Should not have done that. I should not have done that. Waiting for orders. Copy that. Ready for orders. Okay, we're going to be out of the water, so let's not worry about that right now. On the move. Yeah, we got some blips here. What do we got? Timberwolf, Axle 2C, Kodiak, there's a hunter tonner, and a Mars. Okay. Mars needs women. Fire. And we're here to punch them in the face. Missed. You did. It's okay. I'm going to melt that fucker down in a second. Let's only give the Kodiak a shot on us if we can. Ooh, okay. I want to start this way. Okay, looks like we got a few hits in the leg. Ah, uh, we're kind of blocking, uh... Oh, there's a target. Kind of blocking hot damn there, but... It's got a mean debuff, man. It's a really mean debuff. Roger that. Get that leg. Nah. By. Shit, we are blocking her. Alright, not much we can do about it. Pew! I saw that. Uh, they didn't do anything. Order. I don't think we friggin' move. Roger that. Damn it. Oh, I took the shot. Took the shot at it. Had to try. Oh, hello, buddy. What is up? Affirmative. Okay, well, let's, uh... I guess we can only shoot him. <laughs> With one laser. Pew! I'm here. All right, see if this works out. Let's, uh, no, let's hit him with heat. Uh, I'm gonna Warlord this only because I really want to get some heat on this guy as fast as we can. 31 heat, plus another 30. Destroyed a heat sink. Getting 30 because he's standing in fire. Yeah, I want to give another target to that Timberwolf. Uh, we can't offensive push this guy, but we're just going to fire everything. Hopefully we hit the leg. Looked like we did. Yep, we got it. Left leg went down. Did we hit his head too? We did. Wow. Babiega, sharpshooter. That Mars is going to get squashed next turn. Reporting minimal damage. Oh man, that could have been so bad. He's gonna get melted down. What's up, boss? 
Um, do you think he can... Can we get this Mars vehicle without actually using the supercharger? Yes. It's the plasma lance on. Uh, I'm going to come at it from the side, though, I think. For, like, a shit ton. 834 damage. That should probably do it, I think. I don't know. I'm just guessing. Maybe not. Yeah, I think that was probably enough. Just pee on him there at the end. Down. Thank you. Thank you very much. Well. I'm under heavy fire. Yeah, we got some of them. I'm receiving you. Why don't you just go stand hey, beside this guy? It's just like, hey buddy, what's up? Uh, did I tell you something? I told you this, right? You're on fire. Did I tell you you're on fire? I don't know if I told you you're on fire. Pretty sure I did. Oh, he hit his head again. I didn't go for headshots, man. Come on, where's our fire support? Don't worry about the mech right now. We can get him easily enough. Let's see if we can kill this guy. Fire it all. Okay, tags on. Ms. Flowers. Let's give this guy the what for. Nicely done. Vehicle trash. Battle mech power up detected. Ready for order. Now your supercharged uh we turned that off, right? Put down, put down, down, put down, put down, down. I don't know, whenever I see this about this uh I keep calling one a battle master, Black Knight, run across the field, I just think of the six million dollar man. That's why I play that theme in my head every time I see it run. Whoops. Hope we didn't uh, destroy the stuff we're here for. Okay, you just come around this side where the other guy can't see ya. And you just target that leg. Let's just go for the head. What the hell? We might get it. We might not. Even if we don't get it, we're shutting his ass down. What's up, boss? We got a timber wolf needs taken care of. Roger. Let's take care of that, will ya? Uh, let's just shoot him up. Um, let's just leave the rack off for now. Locking up. Come on, buddy. What are you doing? What are you doing? That could have been worse. All right. Sure. God, she's a sharpshooter. You know what I should do for my next series? Just name all my pilots um, based on all the great pilots I've had in my past few series. So Megasaur would be in there, Mockingbird would be in there, Babiago would be in there. Someone made a mention that we should uh, have Mockingbird as the commander for the next series. It's a possibility. It's a possibility. Come on, Kodiak. What are you doing? Oh, shit. Really? I bet you it crashed. Oh, 
Ah, oh, are you kidding me? It's supposed to be this guy's turn now, isn't it? Oh. Man. We were so close to victory. Come on. But I didn't do anything wrong. I didn't do anything wrong. Why you treat me like this? All right, let's restart it. Is it working? Come on, no, ah. All right, restarting. Whoa, that was a weird dream. It's almost like I played that mission out of my mind. I bet you there's a Kodiak and a Timberwolf. Get the hell out of this water. On the move. This time we'll actually attack the ground. Target confirmed. Thank you. Thank you very much. Damn it. Stand in by. Let's get that mask on. Get you out of the water. Moving out. Thank you. Yes, Commander. Same tactics. Same tactics. Man, I was really looking forward to getting that Kodiak too. We definitely would have gotten a lot of pieces from that. Sucks to be me. Okay, let's get that mask off. Get yourself in them trees. What do we got over here? Eris? Okay, I think we have Eris parts actually. If I'm not mistaken. Let's get that supercharger off so we don't wreck it. Let's get into here. Yeah, let's fire the lasers. Mm, just two. Or three, whatever it was. Okay, what else do we got here? Oh, we might have four mechs now. Blood Asp. Okay. Maybe we're going to have harder competition here. Um, yeesh. Shit chances to hit, eh? Not gonna waste a lot of shots on that guy. Systems holding. My guess is that guy's a very, very hot build. Probably to throw a guess out there, so I'm thinking that's where our flame hopper is gonna go. That wasn't my coin in the term. I can't remember who it was to mention that, but. Somebody said Flame Hopper. It's kind of a cool name. I apologize too for all the comments. I've been trying to keep up with them the past couple of days. Like I said, I've been really, really busy. I was on a shoot last night. I was on a shoot all day today. Got home around 8 39 o'clock. So, just recording this episode quickly before I go to bed. Hopefully, after this weekend, like I said, we'll be able to uh, catch back up. I'm trying to get it to everybody's comments, um, and I will, but I just, and if I miss one, I, I apologize. Okay, ghost. Commander? Uh, that's a little better. A little better. Um, holy shit, <laughs> it's a power armor, <laughs> I didn't even see him, guess Vigilance this, let's Warlord this, and then hammer this guy with everything, I want to shut him down. K-9 
can't take the heat, stay out of the match, buddy. <laughs> oh, I don't need the supercharger on for this. <laughs> Sorry, but this is the most... Oh, only 28% chance to hit, though. It's still worth it. <laughs> it's still worth it. Come on, hit. Please hit. Ah! It would have so been worth it. Now he knows what he's up against. He'll think twice. Well, he won't really, but... Alright, pretty good chances to hit. Let's uh, confirm this. We're just going to fire on him. I think we've got extra blood ass parts, so if we can remove the heiress as a threat, then we can get more blood ass parts. Whoosh. Okay, a few hits. Not for long. Man, it's been a while since we've seen a power armor. It's still worth Megasaur kicking the crap out of this guy, though. Alright. Somebody's hot. Got to find a way to get more uh, evasion on this thing. Maybe we put a DNI cockpit with a uh, um, virtual reality suite in it to give it more evasion. Jump around all you want doesn't mean I'm not going to stop on step on you. One of these is going to bound to connect at some point. And when it does, you're dead. Locked on for physical attack. We're going to connect at some point. Whoops, like that. <laughs> uh, it wasn't as satisfying as I was hoping, but uh, let's just melt this guy. May I interest you in some melting armor? Ah, the heiress is deciding to close, eh? Oh shit, something got hit. Well, he's dead. What's up, boss? Location confirmed. Uh, yeah. Wow. Let's hope he blows his legs off. Legs. That's not a leg. Yeah, but it's not a leg. I said the leg. Fuck it. Shoot for his head. Whoops. Oh, we did hit his head. What do you think, Mega, Mega Sorry, for like hunting down a ghost? Probably. Look at the fire! Just getting warmed up for the party. Okay, it's Vigilance this. Maybe we can go before him. Don't know, but we're going to give it a shot. Ah, a little too hot. Firing these four. 
If we go before this guy, he's toast. Um, let's just pull the leg off the blood asp. Right, he's not shut down yet, eh? Um, let's do an OP on him anyway. Um, uh, let's go six with the rack five, sure. That, hit good. that at least pushes him back a little bit. Okay. Yes, All right. Um. Just go right here. Mac is on fire. Let's OP the leg. Shut him down. Shut him. Shut him down. Shut him down. Public enemy, man. It's been a long time since I listened to those guys. All right, let's hammer this guy's leg. 88 left, huh? Ah, uh, yeah, sure. Got it. Have a seat. Oh. Berserker. 96% chance to hit. This guy's fried. See you. I'm still disappointed I can't see those. I'm receiving you. Um Keep going for the leg. As long as we keep him shut down. Now, can we get around the front of him? We can. Don't need to OP this guy, we just need to shoot him. And this leg. Well, I took a lot of damage in the leg. Damn. Alright, let's hammer that leg. There it is. Enemy mech can you say, Sharpshooter, I know you can. Double time. Let's go. Okay, let's just make sure... Okay, leave the supercharger off. I really hope this is it. We got another wave, I'm not that disappointed. Get out of the heat. Roger. Uh, I hope the mask is off. I'm pretty sure it is. Yes, Commander. At least I'm getting more diligent about doing that. On my way. Double time. Full All right, that should be it. There we go. Well, not as good as a Kodiak, but we'll take the blood ass parts. So that's for damn sure. Um, did I take any internals? We did upper leg. Okay, so it's not so bad. That just gets replaced for free, so it's no big deal. All right, now we could take one, two, three, four, five, five blood ass parts. I think we've got one more of a different type. Um, but I want to double check here. <sighs> got three of these already. Ah oh, man. I'm really thinking about um going for components for their for our builds, but because we're out of ex good exchangers. The XL we could take for C bills. Sensor trackers, I think we've got, yeah, we've only got one, but we need two of them for both of the mechs. Nova CEWS would be nice. 
Ah. Uh, why do I keep acquiring mechs that I can't actually put anything into? Well, at least this thing, this guy's got all that stuff integral on him already. Uh, let's just go that route and see what happens. All right, we got the blood ass parts, the heiress part, or oh, hooray, power armor parts, because we need five of those. Uh, I got the inner sphere exchanger, clan double heatsink kit. Yeah, okay. Yeah, could have been better. All right, well. 100,000, we lost some sea bills on that one, but no big deal. I don't think we got a blood ass. No. Nah. Well, at least we got a lot of blood ass parts, so I know now that we can uh, pick one up. We've got enough sea bills for our financial reports. Manage our tasks a little better here. Let's go up here. So it's five days, three for the rest. Yeah, all right. Uh, we're not going to be back before financial report, but I don't think we have any missions here anyway. Don't think anything will pop up. Yeah, there's nothing we can really take here anyhow. So, ah, uh, man. Yeah, I keep forgetting that uh, these guys hate us. Um, we need to jump anyway from away from here. So we're going to go over to... Um, maybe towards more towards Steiner Space. We'll decide that next episode. Um, I don't really have time right now, now to figure it out or do any more missions, unfortunately. Uh, so I'm going to have to leave the episode there. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And you can drop any comments in the comment section down below. Um, and I'm hoping to get back to everybody's comments within the next day or so. Um, so, yeah, I, it's not that I'm not reading them. It's just that I need time to be able to respond to a few of them. So I put um, uh, like and hearts on a bunch of them. Um, the ones that I feel like I didn't absolutely have to respond to. But there's a few that I want to respond to. I've been thinking about the skill system and how it could be improved. Um, there's a few other comments that I want to make uh, some mentions on, but I've actually rethought my idea. Actually, I'm just going to go through that real quick. Um, so the skill system, the way it's set up right now where you just basically choose two um, tasks or whatever, um, I, I'm not a really a big fan of this. Um, these special abilities for pilots, not a huge fan of. Because um, if you think about it, just because someone has chosen tactics down here doesn't mean they wouldn't be able to shoot at multiple targets. You know what I mean? So if you've gone guts and tactics, there's no reason why you couldn't shoot and move, move and shoot, right? It doesn't make any sense. So these, these should be accessible to everybody. But what they should probably do is set up either, like I had mentioned before, um, once you've gotten everything to four here, um, or you're at four and you start to move towards five, then once you choose five in one of the lines, um, you're going to gain the ability no matter who it is that chooses five. But if you choose five in one of these, the rest of these become a little bit more difficult to increase. So you're basically specializing in one line. Um, the other way to think about it too is you could actually go have a favorite system like an A, B, C, D. So like gunnery, piloting, tactics, and guts. And then based on that, that would be the... Um, skill multiplier and how much it will cost to raise up the skills. Um, the other way to do it too would be to do a priority system. So you have like six points and you can add an, a number of priorities into any of your skills. So like let's say two in gunnery, two in piloting, one guts, one tactics. Um, and then when you gain experience it automatically gets slotted percentage wise that way. So um, 32% would go into gunnery, 32% into piloting, 16 in guts, 16% in tactics, and then they would all go up together. So you're not choosing where your experience goes, that just your pilot gains experience overall. And if they're more a gunnery master pilot, then they gain more in gunnery because they're using the skill more often kind of thing. And then these become, once again, baked in skills so that as soon as you get to that point, you get to use it. So even though you've got a pilot with really good gunnery, they can still melee really well, right? Um, once they gain a certain amount of experience, they'll still be able to do mailing. They'll still be able to, um, you know, um, use their ace pilot ability or something or whatever you want to call it, right? So it would just kind of raise up and everyone would get to use all the skills the higher level they went. Because somebody who's got tens all across the board, to, to think that they couldn't do a, uh, um, a, a, uh, a sensor's ability or, you know, uh, um, whatever uh, juggernaut ability, they'd still be like 
that at that pilot at that level would just know how to do just about everything. So anyway, that's just my two cents. This is simplest this is a simple system and it works, but I don't think it's the most effective one personally. So yeah, just my two cents. Anyway, leaving the episode there. Um, yeah, until next time, we'll see everybody later.